I've got Jonathan Dean with me. Jonathan graduated from Ham, uh, from Bethel in 93? 94. 94, and he was happened to be on the state championship team for basketball and football in 1993 yes. and 92. Yep. Well, tell us a little bit about what you have been doing since then. Uh, since then, I graduated from James Madison. Um, then I played a little arena ball. Then actually uh, became the head of strength and conditioning at um, Christopher Newport University, also a defensive line coach. All right, so you've stayed with your, your roots in, in football rather than basketball, but I can see that <laughs> you being a strength coach, you kind of let these guys know that you can lift too. Let's talk a little bit, bit about that being the, uh, the conditioning coach and how you stay in shape. Uh, you know, guys want to test me all the time, so I got to make sure I, I stay in shape myself so, I, so they can show what I'm doing and making sure they can see that it, it works. Well, now, doing strength and coaching and lifting weights is just not just get out there doing. There is technique so that you don't hurt yourself Correct. and, mm -hmm. and how to, to build your muscles. So it's more than just lifting weights, isn't it? Oh, most definitely. It's, it's, uh, we do, do deal with nutrition. We deal with the uh, conditioning aspect, developing speed, um, developing power. It's uh, all types of aspects we have to do. And, you know, not just gaining weight. You also have to work with other athletes, have to lose weight. So... They, they even come to me for counseling, so it's just a multifaceted deal. All right, now let's go back in time here. <laughs> let's talk about your experience winning the state football and state basketball championship at Bethel High School. Um, even the older I get, the more I look back on it, it's the more amazing it is. Uh, Y'all show uh, those games and everybody keeps calling me about them, and I, I, some, I don't even want to watch them anymore, but it's, it's an amazing feeling to win football and basketball, even win the state championship, because not too many people can say that. Right. So uh, was that something you was able to take on with you when you went on to college and then after college? Um, it was, I kind of had to put it on a back burden when I got to college because, you know, everybody was all this and all that, and, you know, there was a couple of people who had won a state championship on um, – and uh, your goals kind of uh, go towards trying to win a national championship or a conference championship. So you kind of put that on the back burner. But now, now that I finished playing ball, I can look back on it and kind of smile and and like, okay, I did, really actually did that. So it's it's a good feeling right now. Well, I tell you, you stayed in good shape. You look real good, and I want to congratulate you on your life. You've done great, and you got a lot of good things ahead of you. I, I appreciate it. Good enough. Okay, thanks again. This is Bob Hintz.